Hello guys, it's Mac Moon here, and today I'm going to show you three tricks on the program MS Paint. As you can tell by my videos, I use Paint Tool Sci, but I used to use Paint. So in this video, I'm going to show you three tricks I used when I used Paint. Trick one. So here we have a drawing, and we a fabulous drawing with a fabulous sketch. Oh no, I did my outline and I can't remove my sketch. Never fear. Here is how you remove your sketch. So, take the color that you use for your sketch, which will remain in the this. And zoom out. Get your eraser. I'm gonna get the keyboard. On screen keyboard. See if this works. You press Control and Plus. Okay, so Control and Plus. Okay, okay. so Control and Plus. See, you press Control and Plus and hold at the same time. Okay, and then you right click and just move. And move it around your drawing till all the stupid pesky sketch lines are gone. And there you go. You have an outline. Trick two. Pen pressure. If you don't know what pen pressure is, it is a thing that you have with a Wacom tablet or any type of tablet, drawing tablet. It's where the lines can go smooth like like this and not so like just like still like that. Oh, okay, I'm gonna show you how to do this on the paint. Okay, so we have my magnificent animal jam deer here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take the color white and we're gonna use our pencil. And here's okay, here's a tip: only do the edges, like an edge right here. Oh God, there's a little bit out. And it's never erased. The edge right here. Kind of smoothen that down till it kind of has a point. But don't like erase the whole thing and don't like make it too solid or don't make it too thin. But yeah, and I'll use another tip for this: use the thickest size of pencil, which is this right here. But for the for the um, pen pressure part, you may want to use the smallest, the first two sizes for the white, because you don't want to like erase the whole thing like this. So we're going to go in at the edges, like here, and make them pointy, pointy. And I am just going to continue doing that until all of my lines are smooth. Okay, now I have my complete outline, pen pressure and everything. Well, not really pen pressure, fake pen pressure. Trick 3. Trick 3 is one of the most complicated steps in this tutorial. Okay, so first what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the, quickly get the colors of my deer. And make a little thing with them. Actually, I should not. I shouldn't do that yet. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna do this. Okay. I'm gonna erase this with my Control Plus. Okay. So, okay. So. Haven't you ever been coloring and all of a sudden, <gasps> oops, you drew over the lines. Crap, now you're crying. You're in deep pain. Never fear. I have cure for that. So take one color, set it as your second color, and fill in the whole entire picture with just that one color. No questions asked. 
Oh, and I need to do this too. Okay, you got this. This is the color, and then zoom out all the way. The reason we're doing this is that we can get a good selection of it. And it doesn't like turn out all wacky. So, turn on transparent selection. Select all. Copy. Okay. Next thing we're going to do is the yada yada color your character. Oh, yeah, I'm going to paste that picture again. Don't ask what I have in my files. Okay. Here is it. Here it is. I'm going to get this color. And here's another. Here's a tip. The airbrush does really good shading. Really good. So you can spray in lines. No worries or anything. Spray it in areas. Okay, here's the next tip. Zoom out to so it's like this. And then press paste. It's gone. Like magic. And the problem is we have some of that stuff in the white area. It's supposed to be white, but I'll tell you how to clear that later. So I'm just gonna keep on shading not worrying about my line art because of course you can fix that well you can fix it too if you did it right shading shading darker I'm gonna make the size a bit smaller because I don't want to like that oh god okay make it smaller more like this it's kind of like a little edge, almost. But the airbrush is really good for shading. Then I got all that done. Zoom out. Paste. There we go. Now I'm gonna color in these sections. White. Oh, why did I even put it here? That's so stupid of me. But I'm actually gonna go here and color over these lines. And then zoom out. I'm, go I'm gonna pause the recording and then sh okay, and then continue it when I'm finished with getting rid of all this. Okay, so I am done with all the shading and stuff. And yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Now I'm going to go touch up this picture. So this is the final product. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Be sure to slap that like button so hard that it's face please. And make sure, and if you don't like this video, and if you dislike this, get out. The exit is this way. Get out of my channel. Get out. Now. Shoo, shoo. Get out. But anyway, slap that subscribe button. This is MacMoon signing off. Bye.